Hi, this is Jessie. I'm here in the Eating Well Test Kitchen and I'm going to show you two ways to cook one of the best fall vegetables, sweet potatoes. First thing you need to know when you're at the store, this is what you want to look for. Smooth, taut, papery skins. They should have tapered ends and no soft spots or bruises. Bring these guys home and you can store them for literally months. Just make sure you put them in a cool, dark place, like in your pantry or in a drawer. Don't put them in the refrigerator. Now, when you're ready to cook them, take them out, run them under cold, running water and scrub them off. First way I'm gonna cook them today is pan steaming. So I take my clean sweet potatoes, I chop them into one inch chunks, put those into a skillet, pour a little bit of broth in, a little bit of honey, thyme, put the top on, let it simmer about 15 minutes until they're almost tender. At that point, remove the lid, let that liquid cook down over high heat for about two more minutes and it's gonna reduce and it's just gonna glaze those sweet potatoes. It will be delicious. Second way, this is something that every cook should have in their arsenal, it's roasting sweet potatoes. This is a basic. So you take your sweet potatoes, you cut them in half lengthwise, then cut those into half inch wedges, spread them out on a baking sheet, toss those with a little bit of olive oil and salt, then you put them into a hot 500 degree oven and you roast them for about 25 to 30 minutes until they're tender. Turn them once about halfway through. That's it. You've just got two ways to cook sweet potatoes. And the good news is these guys are loaded with beta carotene. That's gonna help keep your eyes healthy. Plus they have more fiber than white potatoes. Now, final tip, make sure you eat those skins because that's where a lot of the nutrients are. For more healthy veggie cooking tips like this, come to eatingwell.com.